hello and very warm welcome to yet another video tutorial hope you are doing great in today's video we are going to learn about ui label control and how we can create an ui label in swift programmatically so let's start this is uh, i'm doing for the beginners so open up your xcode yeah create a new xcode project select a single view application here and press next name it your project as your label tutorial one and language will be swift and we will save it on our hard drive or flash drive and name it this create and we will create it so here at the Xcode generated a single view application template so we are not going to use storyboard we are going to use uh, UI label programmatically so in a view controller we will create let text or let's say user name is equals to UI label dot in it so whenever when you press dot and press escape you will see the intelligence here it shows you every method that your level class provides so we'll first we will init it in it in it has different method in it in it with coder in it with frame so we will set it in it and then username dot frame because frame is required so that uh, label will be positioned at a particular uh, point on our screen so we will say cg rect and here we will say x so every control has four coordinates x position y position its width and its height so we will say the 10 and here we will say 40.0 and width will be 100 and height we will say 21.0 so username dot text text is a property that the current text that is displayed by the label is equals to swift tutorials and here the last thing we will do we will add to our view that is self dot view dot add subview is called username and let's see if we run our app on iPhone 10, we will see our label showing Swift tutorial on our app screen. So next code here is showing that it's launching UI table view tutorial one. There is no ever no warning so far. So here our app gets launched in iPhone 10 simulator. So here you can see that the Swift tutorial is written. So now in order to change the font and other styles, we can do it like this way. Say so it's username dot font is equals to UI font and here we say that name and size so we will say name will be Vatana and size will be 20.0 so now let's see what happens when we apply font to our label and here it says now that is truncate dot 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 because that doesn't fit the width so we have to increase our width so let's see we will do that ui screen dot main dot bounce dot size dot width and minus 20 because we want to leave space 10 pixel from the left side and 10 from the right side so here we will see and now the swift row will appear correctly So 
so here you can see the swift tutorial is shown now if you want to place it to on right or left then we can use username dot text alignment that is the alignment whether to center or left or right is equals to dot by default it's left because we are using LTR format that is left to right and it's con and English is in left to right format so if you press center then it will show the text in the center so here our Swift tutorial is in the center so if we change it to the right then it will be shown on the right hand side of the screen so here you can so you can also change the text color by using username dot text color is equals to dot yellow and let's see what happens the uh, label text color will be changed to yellow color and here you can see what is not readable so let's change it to some dark and we will give it a blue color and here you can see the blue is looking clearly it's just tutorials and so this is the uh, the color and the font and alignment so these are the basic properties uh, used to create a label or whenever you want to access a label whether programmatically or uh, or using storyboard so in this tutorial we learn about it how to create UI label programmatically in Swift and I am going to cover whole series of UI label that uh, providing attributed text to the label and other objects that number of lines etc etc so let's see number of lines also so now you suppose if we change our text to like this provides iOS tutorials on Swift what I just told you on Swift in very informative videos on YouTube channel so let's see what happens when we run it you will see that our text goes truncate again so here you can see Swift Tutorial provides iOS tutorial and the rest of the text is drunk because by default the lines number of lines of a U level is set to one. So for this one thing we have to do we have to set UI dot number of lines is equals to zero means that it can be number of lines depends upon its height and also we have to change its height. So we have we will make it like 50 and now we will run and we will see that whole text is adopted by our label so here you can see swift story provide is storage on swift in very information but still it's cutting because the height is not suitable so we need to increase more height and suppose we will give it to 100 and and we will place it to dot left and here you can see now the, there are four lines so now all the information shown by label correctly so this is the very basic tutorial that shows how to create a UI label programmatically and use the basic properties of a label that is frame, text, font, text alignment, text color and number of lines and we are going to cover this UI label series in our future videos too and we will learn more about your label so if you like this video then please like this video and do subscribe our channel so that you can get you will get a notification or update whenever we post a new video thanks for watching bye bye